Welcome to the second video of Dapoli. In the last video, we took you through the ghats of Tamini to reach Dapoli, where we experienced a sunset and explored Karde Beach. If you have not watched that video, then check for the link in description. And today, we will be visiting a beautiful Ganpati temple named Kadavarsa Ganpati in Anzarli village. It's the morning guys and who wouldn't want to wake up to this view? Hearing these waves in the morning was the ultimate relaxation. Beautiful, isn't it? If you see, we just have to cross the road to get to the beach. And this is the reason we chose this resort. It's gonna be a long day. But before we start, Breakfast. Another wonderful experience of having the breakfast with the stunning view of sea. There are two ways to reach the temple. One is via Palspandari village and the other is the coastal highway. The road to the village is very crowded and so we took the scenic coastal highway where you can spend some time at Harney viewpoint. From here, the view of the ocean was magnificent. You see this view? Isn't this amazing? This is the reason we took this coastal highway and not the one which goes to the village. So, Next time when you plan your trip, take the coastal highway. This is the perfect place guys to get away from all your troubles. We just sat there for a while staring at the ocean and we were stunned looking at its beauty. We went further on the coastal highway and stopped at a place from where you get the wonderful view of the historical fort named Suvarnadurg and the ocean of course. It was lush green guys, green grass field on one side and the grey sky and the grey ocean on the other. Amazing! And again. We just sat there and kept staring at the majestic ocean. We have reached the beautiful Ganapati temple called Kadavarsa Ganapati. If you are planning a trip to Dapoli, don't forget to visit this temple which was built in the year 1780. This Ganapati temple comprises of Shiv temple, Karas and the footprints of Ganapati. Speciality of this temple is 
that Ganpati idol has carvings of his both wives Riddhi and Siddhi. Also, this temple is an excellent example of Peshwa architecture. Right beside this main temple, there is a Shiv temple. And we offered prayers in this Shiv temple. We then move to Karas. This temple has one main Karas and 16 smaller Karas. The main Karas is carved with Ashtavinayak Ganpatis on it. Now, there is something which adds beauty to this temple. A pond which is located right opposite to the temple. It is believed that this temple was at the seashore in the ancient days. The same seashore was the home to other two temples of Mahadev and Siddhi Vinayak. Rising sea waves caused damage to the temples and hence these temples were moved to this mountain and this is the reason it is called as Kadavar Saganapati. In the end, we decided to visit the temple which marks the footprints of Ganpati. It is assumed that when the temple was being shifted, Ganpati had to put his one step in the ocean and the second one right here on this mountain. This is the reason this small temple has been built to mark his footprints. This was the temple of Kadavarsa Ganapati. We had a very good time here at this temple. We loved its history, its architecture and its surrounding. Temple is very peaceful guys and you can easily spend 1 to 2 hours here. So when you are in Dapoli, don't forget to visit this temple. Ok, time to go back to the hotel and enjoy at the beach. It was raining very heavily when we reached back. It's monsoon guys and it's expected. In fact, we were very lucky to experience the monsoon in Konkan. And here we are out again, posing and enjoying at the beach. Shravil is enjoying the beach all by himself and seems to be getting comfortable with the ocean. As a parent, we must give them their space and time and help them to overcome their fears, isn't it? Just like any other traveller, we have found our bliss at this beach and we are carrying all the good memories with us. Alright guys, time to leave and we will stop here and see you in the next video. Bye! If you have liked this video, please don't forget to hit the like button and please do subscribe to our channel. Stay healthy and keep traveling. In the next video, we will be visiting a beautiful Zolai temple in Asud village. So, stay tuned.